Hi there, I want to show you how you can order featured articles within Joomla by category and article. I must admit I'm fairly new to Joomla myself, so still learning it, and I've had some difficulties really getting my head around this. So I've produced this little video in the chance that uh, I can help somebody else who's going through the same problems. Now to show all this, I've set up some test data, and you can see that on this little diagram here. I've written nine articles and imaginatively called them first article, second article, third article, all the way down to ninth article. And I've put those into three categories, as you can see. So the first column here I've called category A, and I've put the first, fourth, and seventh articles into that. Into category B, I've put second, fifth, and eighth articles. And into category C, the third, sixth, and ninth articles. Let's see what that looks like in Joomla. Here we have the articles. So you can see ninth article in category C, eighth article in category B, seventh article in category A, all the way down to the first article. First article in category A. And you can see, and if I click on the categories, there's the three categories, category A, category B, category C. And the other thing I've done is I've created a menu item, which is featured articles. So it's a type featured articles. So these are the articles that I've put in. And if you go back to the featured articles item, you can see all of those articles I've put in as featured articles. Yeah, the, the ordering is a bit unclear here because it's ordered by title ascending. If I change that ordering to be by ID ascending, say, you can see the nine articles there. So I put all those nine articles in as featured articles, allocated those through to the various categories and created this menu item which I've put on the home page which is all of these articles together. So let's have a look and see what that looks like on the site. Just a short plug here for Cam Studio which is an excellent bit of software which I'm using for recording this video. So here is the site and this is the order they, they've appeared in. They've got the 7th first, 4th first, 8th, 5th, 2nd, 9th, 6th, and then 3rd. So why on earth has it come out in this order? Well, you can see that the 1st, 2nd, and 3rd are all category A, which gives us a clue. And then the next ones are category B, and the next one's category C. Um, and then in, within the 7th, 4th, 1st, so they're kind of in reverse numerical order, 8th, 5th, 2nd, 9th, 6th, 3rd. But let's look and see, at the, see why they're actually in that order. So if we go to this home page, this is the menu item which is defining that featured article. And if we go to the layout tab here, and we scroll down a bit, we see two things. We see category order and article order. And Joomla allows us the ability to order those blog or news items, those, those featured articles, first of all by category and then by article order. And what it's got here is it's saying that for this item, we use the global settings for both category order and article order. Now what are those global settings? Well, if we go along to the system tab here, whoops, sorry, I've got to close that first. If we go to the system tab and global configuration, and we go down to articles here on the left, click on that. Shared options over here on the right, you see these settings applied for shared options in list, blog, and featured, unless they're changed by the menu settings. So we've got category order here, 
and it's ordering by category manager order right? and then article order it's putting most recent first so if we look at the way it came out category order it's come yes category order there's all the category A ones then the category B ones category C ones and within the category order it's putting out in most recent first so I started off by putting the the first article then they wrote the second article and then the third article so the most recent article will be the ninth article and then the eighth article and so on and you can see that within the category order the higher number of articles are appearing before the lower number of articles so that seems to fit it's putting them first of all in category order and then in most recent first order so what happens if we don't really want that order on a website? Well, we've got a couple of options. We can either change these defaults here so that they apply to all things, or we can change the individual menu item, um, our particular instance, so that it is different from what the category and sorry what the default category order and article order are so let's let's take the first option first let's change the default across the board so let's say well we want the category order in title reverse alphabetical and we want the article order in well let's say against title alphabetical order and we'll save that and then see what we should get. We expect then title reverse alphabetical, we expect to get C, then B, then A, and then within C, B, and A, we expect the articles to be in title alphabetical order. Let's try that. We'll reload this page. Yep, category C first, category B, category A, that looks good. And then within each category, We've got 9th, 6th, 3rd, yes, that's an alphabetical order, okay. 8th, 5th, 2nd, yep. And 1st, 4th, 7th, yep. So that fits quite well. Um, what we can also do, we can say, well, let's not bother with ordering by category. Let's have no order by category. Let's just order the articles alphabetically. We'll save that again. And we'll do a reload. And that's looking good. 8th, 5th, 1st, 4th, 9th. So you can see that all of these articles are in fact in alphabetical order. OK. So that is really changing the global defaults. But what happens if we don't want to change the global defaults? We can leave those the way that they were. And we can go in and change the items change the individual options for the particular menu item. So I've changed it back to the default. So when I click on reload, it'll come back to the default. The first, um, firstly ordered by category and then by most recent article within a category. So to change it for the particular menu item, we go to that particular menu item and we click on it. And we go back to the Layout tab, and this is where we saw previously that it was using the global options. So it was using Category Order, Use Global, Article Order, Use Global. So we can change this menu item individually to differentiate it from the global options. Let's try something different. Let's try Title Reverse Alphabetical for this one. And uh, let's say... Let's put oldest first then, and we'll save that. So we would expect to see category order CBA and then article order oldest first. Remember the first article was the oldest, second article was the second oldest and so on. And let's see what happens now. I'll click on that. Yep, sure enough, category C has come out first then category B, then category A, and then within each category, yes, the third, the sixth, the ninth, second, fifth, 
eighth, yeah, that looks good. First, fourth, seventh, yeah. So it is actually giving us the uh, the articles as old as first within each category. What we can also do then is we can say, well, let's use the category manager order here and leave this here and we'll save and close that. So we'll look at the category manager and see, well, what, what order is it giving them in? It's giving them category A, then B, then C. And we've set it to be A, then B, then C. But of course, if we have genuine categories like news, latest news or something like that, we may not have it in alphabetical order. So we may want to change the order of these. And that's where we use this little three, three dots on the left hand side. We can change the order of these by pressing that and then moving it up. So now we've got the order, the category order is C, then A, then B. And let's see what that does. I'll reload that again. Yep, we've got C, then A, then B. And within each category, we've still got the same ordering, the third, the sixth, the ninth. And that's because if we go back to this menu item here, Articles for Ordering, we have got, go out to the Layout tab, using category manager order so whatever order appears in the category manager order and then the next one we're using the oldest first um, the other thing that we can do is we can change this if we really don't want to use any of the standard um, ways of ordering the articles like oldest first or alphabetical or something like that we can use the featured articles order and let's change this first of all to no order. Right, okay. So we're now setting this to be no order in the category, but we're using the featured articles order to all order those. And if we go into the featured articles, we see that, well, they're ordered by ID ascending. Let's see what happens when we click on this. Okay, we're getting 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th. And if we look at this ordering in here, we see, yes, it's 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th. But what if we want to change that? Well, that's where we need to be able to reorder this column here. And there's a couple of ways that we can get into it. We can either click on that ordering item. Or we can change this here. We'll put this back to title ascending. We can change this here. We can put this order ascending, something like this. And this allows us to change the ordering of these items. And um, we just do it by putting the clicking these little arrows. So if we want to move the first article down, click on that, and you see now it's article two. If we can move it down again. And it's article three. So now we've got the second article is the first, the third article is the second, and the first article is third, and then fourth and fifth are in the right order. So let's see whenever we go to the site and click on that. And sure enough, the second article, third article, first article, fourth article. So the first article has been moved down from first to third according to this. And we've set it off so that there's no ordering by categories. But of course we can order by categories as well. So if we were going into this menu and home page. And click on this menu item again. We can go back into layout. And we can pick a category order. Category manager order. Save and close. And let's just remind ourselves what the category manager order was. 
we've got C, then A, then B. Okay, so let's go and click on that. And what we find, yes, C, then A, then B. And then if we want to change the articles, here's the ordering of the articles. Now they're in the same order really as they, they were because I haven't moved the first below the fourth. So you're still getting here, you're still getting the first above the fourth, say. But if I take this first article and move it down one more, we then see that the first article is below the fourth article in this. And if we click on this again, we see in category A, the fourth article is moved up, the first article is done down. So really what Joomla is doing, it's ordering first of all by the category. We've told it to order first of all by the category. And then within each category, we've told it to order by this order here within the featured articles. So that gives us a lot of uh, flexibility. Um, just remember that we order first of all by category. So if we, we set up the, the category order first of all, and then we can do whatever we like within that category using the uh, featured articles and uh, the ordering of the articles. So uh, hopefully, hopefully this has been some help to some, help to some people. Thanks for listening. Bye-bye.